WJCL News. WJCL News at 6. Working for you. WJCL News at 6 with an update to our breaking story at 5. Our top story rather. Three men were shot in Savannah during a home invasion on DeLesseps Avenue. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kevin Holmes. Jennifer has a night off. WJCL, Chelsea McDonald working for you. Chelsea, I understand you've uncovered more since our last report. Yeah, detectives are still sorting out details, but the triple shooting happened during morning rush hour just before 8. Officers found weapons and illegal drugs in the house. Now, this raises the number of aggravated assaults with a gun to more than 180 this year. That's up more than 30 from last year. Neighbors are disturbed that a triple shooting was so close to home. They're crying out stop the violence and stop the killings. Today, Savannah City leaders voiced their concerns, fearful the crimes usually at night are now happening during the day. Every social media platform is talking about the crime problem in Savannah. And at some point, at some point, folks are getting scared enough to start throwing those for sale signs up and starting to leave town because mm -hmm. they think that we're not doing or can't do anything about it. Alderman Tony Thomas hopes church leaders will help encourage the community to put an end to crime. I spoke to a pastor who held a prayer rally last night. They prayed for men to step up and be positive role models. The triple shooting did happen during rush hour, so officers are hoping someone will speak out and help them get information. Reporting in the studio, Chelsea McDonald, WJCL News, working for you.